ladies and gentlemen i have found the best br class setup. you're gonna want to watch this video all the way through i have it okay this is the br that will get you all the max stats you want to watch this this is it let's hop into it Two, I give up, Cave. One on ball. Two on ball. One A dead. The other one A dead. Last case ball. Last case oh, ball. They got a heat wave. They got a heat wave. Oh my gosh, I'm about to get an overkill. They're going uh, right side. Left side. From there, so. I got him. I got two. Oh, he's one shot. I got him. One, one more on flag. I got three. You guys seen those clips? Look, I mean, this this is the absolutely the best. Look at the clip. Okay, these are the, this is the best attachments. You want the Onyx sticker thing, and you want the onyx recon this is onyx right <laughs> this is for getting onyx or maybe it's not you want whatever this one is i thought this was for getting onyx recon you want the recon battle buddy guy the epic charm and you want the onyx emblem that's the best class you're welcome let's hop into a game and show you guys how incredible this thing is full disclosure this is my first halo match for the last two days all right we were just streaming some overwatch so if i you know i'm a little rusty that's why i had to uh you know you're gonna notice that this game started a little late that's because as soon as our game started one of my teammates spammed in the chat up a word you're not allowed to say so we had to get rid of it but here we are we're in the diamond two lobby solo duos and what i mean this br guys i mean it's, these attachments you guys don't even understand okay when you have this sticker on your gun yeah, I mean, it's just beautiful. It's just, I mean, you have the ACOG side on there. You don't even need to use it. You just hip fire with it. It's just incredible. It's it's so good that I even got to use the th Oh, I'm lagging. Why am I lagging? I have 17 ping. Why was I lagging there? Don't know. Oh, here we go. We're hopping on. Okay, didn't even need to. Didn't even need to. I hit him with zero bullets anyway. Guys, I am having the hardest time. I'm playing Claw with the PS5 controller these days. Uh, I used to play PS4 controller. But I don't know why, like, oh no, you have the sword. <laughs> Look how good this battle rifle is. You literally just destroy kids with the sword, dude. Like, it doesn't matter. But back to what I was saying before I was rudely interrupted was I play on the PS4 controller, but for some reason, like, my last three PS4 controllers just straight up. Do you have high alert on or what? Do you have high, how do you know? But my last PS4, last, like, few PS4 controllers, they just disconnect, like, randomly, like, in the middle of a game. And every time I set the controller down, Super annoying, I think it's because of the micro USB connection, not a type C. So I switched to a PS5 controller and playing claw on a PS5 controller. Oh no, he's better than me. He's better than me throwing that. But playing claw on a PS5 controller is a lot harder because the controller is bigger, but this is getting used to it. You know, I bet if I had, I bet if I had my BR out back there, I would have lived that. I mean, look at this. I'm taking this fight from downtown. You know what I'm saying? I'm just vibing. There's two here. Doesn't matter. Nade and BR. That's all I need. You're lucky. You're lucky. There's a guy there. I see. Okay. Because this, the best BR in the game, would not have lost that gunfight. You didn't have your teammate there to save you. I've been having this weird dilemma lately about how I face my camera. And you guys probably don't even notice like literally any difference at all because there's really not. But I, I keep micro like moving. The sword. It's mine again. I keep micro moving the camera. Oh, I didn't mean to throw that controller. So that was just me using the PS5 controller claw and like actually hitting the trigger for grenades. Uh, but yeah, I keep like moving it barely and it's just because I don't know I just whenever I that's like my hardest thing about YouTube and streaming and all that is I just like can never I'm never satisfied with like what I'm like the quality of my stuff I'm always changing something and then friends like the instance like I've changed the like, camera angle like 82 times Literally, it's it always looks like basically the exact same, but it just like looks different enough to me and sometimes I love it, and sometimes I hate it. So this is one of those things. Oh, look at this. You know, there, it's because there's two. Okay, those, that's the only reason I lost. I, not because I missed any shots. The battle rail would never fail me. Not with this class setup. Active camo's up. We gotta go for that. I'm invisible. Is there, is there even a full team? Well, I'm going four and six. I might be the best to ever do it. With the greatest battle rifle in the game, dude. These guys all must like be copying my battle rifle class setup. It's the only way. No, I'm living. I'm li I couldn't live. It's because those two, the battle rifle would never fail me there. It's time to go in it all in and just start slaying. Wow, this guy's just shooting me across map. He must have my battle rifle setup. There's another one here. There's another one chasing me. Chase me. I don't lose these. I lose those sometimes, but that yeah, I, it's only sometimes that that guy must have had my battle rifle set up. There's no way I would have lost that otherwise. You know, one thing I actually have the hardest time uh, about in Halo is like there are so many times like right now like we're winning by like a mile, right? But because in this game it's so challenging for me to like drop high kills, like right there, like I I I mean I just like keep losing these gunfights and it makes me feel so annoyed when I'm not dropping like a hundred kills. I can call duty just so easy to drop like 40 kills 
know what I'm saying? It's like when you drop 40 kills, you're like, wow, I did good that game. Even though realistically, like, in a game like Call of Duty, dropping 40 kills, like, in a chaotic hard point, really isn't that, like, big of an achievement. But in this game, like, the assists don't count towards your eliminations like COD does now, you know? So, like, COD just makes you feel better, like, when they do that. Um, I'm chasing you. I don't have any nades, unfortunately, but I'm still gonna chase. Wait, you're not in that corner? Are you in this? Wait, where'd the Christmas guy go? See, like, right there, like, doesn't count as one of my elims. So, is what it is, though. Let's see here. I feel like my teammates just, like, letting them... Oh, he has Mangler. See, another assist, you know? I feel like my teammates are just letting... Get, get out of here. I see you. I'm invisible. I'm gonna take that kill. Thank you. Finally, I, I need to get some... You know what I'm saying? I need some of the kills. Thank you. Well, we're most certainly winning this game. I mean, and, you know, I'm not that surprised. Like I said, I mean, just this battle I fell... Battery I feel just doesn't lose. I mean, look at that guy. I didn't even need to aim, okay? I just pop him, lock him, drop him, and that's it. That's the end of the game. You're welcome. You're welcome for this class setup. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you guys, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the, the channel, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Goodbye.